Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can check if Microsoft Copilot is turned on. So let's get right into it. Uh, now, uh, this, as you can see on my screen, is a tutorial on how to remove it from your taskbar, but this will pretty much be the same exact process you'll be doing. So what you need to do is go to the Windows Start button, type in Settings and open the settings, then go to Personaliz Personalization, then into Taskbar, and then toggle off the Copilot if you want it off, or turn it on to make sure that it's it is turned on. You can toggle it on or off to restart it and double check if it is available. However, this is only for the taskbar. To make sure that it is on, uh, you will have to actually enter Copilot. And if it is in the bottom right of your screen, if you're on Windows 10, on Windows 11, I'm not sure, uh, you will be able to enter it and make sure that it works. Now, uh, to make sure that it is enabled for applications, I do have other tutorials. However, shortly, you need to click on the file menu in the top left of any office application, navigate to settings, go to advanced settings, then to editor settings or whatever that sort of tab is called. Then once you're there, you'll have this check mark next to enable copilot if it is enabled. If it is not, then check it on. And that will be pretty much the entire process to enable your copilot in your applications. I'm not sure if you have to do it, do it individually for all applications or if you have to do it only for one and then it is enabled globally. However, that is the only process that I know of. That is the only way that you can check if it works. But yeah, uh, and yeah, if you're using the application, it will appear at the top at the right hand side of your screen. And that will also tell you if it is on or not. And yeah, that's been pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll be seeing you guys next time.